We've had so much rain in the last few days that the water, is, it came in sideways into the cage. It soaked up through the ground. It's a right raw mess in there. So I'm just going to take a look. I'm probably going to have to clean it out, I think. It was getting towards the end of the, the bedding in there anyway. So it's, it's not the end of the world, but yeah, it's a mess. So I'm going to have to take a look at it now. Looks like they've found some dry land. <laughs> yeah. It's basically just turned to a quagmire. All the food's kind of got wet. Yeah, they look they look very miserable. I have to let it dry because it'll be too heavy to clean. And it's gonna stink for a couple of days. So in a couple of days, days time, I've got plenty of work ahead of me. I've tried to clean these cages out before when they've been really wet and it's it's really heavy and it's kind of backbreaking. So I'm just gonna let it dry for a few days and then get stuck in. I've cleaned out the cage, got rid of that waterlogged bedding. It's um, a lot cleaner now. It's still quite wet and it does smell, so I'm gonna leave it for a couple of days to dry out. But the quail will be fine, they're digging around finding worms and other bugs. So that's fine, I'll just let it dry and then I'll go put the bedding in. It's dried out and it's not smelling as bad now, so I'm going to spend some time to lay out some garden soil. Soil is down. Quail are enjoying it, so I'm going to put some mulch on now. Mulch is in, some greenery. And they're looking... Pretty happy to be exploring. 